Sponsored by yours truly, 10 Jeezy, less than three. Hey, what's up, Skunky? Thanks for being here. Thanks, 10 Gigahertz, for the sponsorship. <laughs> what's up, Skunky? Hey, um... Last time you had mentioned the 15% uh, attack speed gem, I remembered I had one, and I have been to get this uh, sword that was an update for me. It's kind of goofy, <laughs> because I have Arctic Blast, which is hilarious. Wow! <laughs> But the sword itself is pretty good, but I I decided to uh, socket it with um, on normal difficulty, uh, Act 5 or whatever. So I, uh, it's 40% increased attack speed, so it's pretty pretty good. The jewel in it's the 15% attack speed. So it's, it's definitely night and day, like wait Wait till you see if you hang around uh, my magic attack, the Berserk. This is funny. It's really fast, though. <laughs> How you doing, man? Good to see you. I already have the cube, of course. And I already went through the Halls of the Dead, but I realized that I didn't get the waypoint in level 2. And for some reason, I feel like I need to get all the waypoints. So I'm going to dive back into the Halls of the Dead. Playing some Magic the Gathering, saw you went live. Nice. How are you and the fam today? Okay. Uh, Baby G wasn't sleeping from like 1 till 4 in the morning or something. He's sleeping right now, thankfully. Uh, but, you know, another day of uh, getting up at like 3.30 in the morning. My wife was with him at first. So we're good, except uh, just another long ass, tiring day. Let's see what this jewel is. Three to seven cold damage. No thanks. What a lad keeping his parents up. Yeah. What a guy. He had a good Halloween yesterday, though. His daycare had a trunk or treat, which I don't know if you know what that is across the pond. But basically, in lieu of going trick-or-treating, people come, like parents come and decorate their cars and hand out candy like in the parking lot. So that's what we did yesterday. He was a, a Triceratops. So he had a kind of like two parties at daycare. And then some snacks at home. So, pretty good Halloween, I'd say, for him. I was pretty proud of his costume. Like, we just bought it somewhere. But there was probably, like, five or six Spider-Men. Like, all the kids wearing the same Spider-Man costume. Let me tell you something. Not only was Baby G the only dinosaur, for sure he was the only Triceratops. So, I was... Happy that he wasn't just a uh, cookie cutter like everybody else. Was it one of the blow up T Rex costumes? No, I know I know what those are though. I've seen those. This was just like a like a full body piece of clothing, I guess you would say, that you would could put on, and then a little like a hat that was like a Triceratops with the horns, you know. It's cute.
Let me tell you, it's something I normally would not care about at all, except for the fact that my kid is involved, so of course I love it. But it's certainly not usual for me to give two hoots about a trunk or treat, but... Look how fast the Berserk is. Get back here! Anyway, man, it's nice that you could stop by. I'm just gonna play Diablo for another hour and a half here and uh, see what we can do. Yeah, Halloween's definitely my favorite. I love the fall season in general. And Halloween's just all that much better because I like horror movies and stuff. Uh, let me tell. <clears throat> let me tell you though. The older I get, I do absolutely nothing to honor the occasion. I didn't watch any movies or anything. Just too busy playing video games. Bye. There's lots of monsters in here. And my my minion died, I didn't even notice. Or my companion rather. <clears throat> Just a couple monsters in here. Still playing Magic the Gathering? Uh oh. Oh dear. Uh, not exactly good. God damn. What a salty dog. Salt. Salt. I know. Every time I die, I think of Skunky's words. Leap. I don't have a point in leap, though, but I guess... Certainly would have helped. Dang it. I tell you, I never usually, like, would get cornered like that. Until recently. Good evening. Don't even have enough gold! Well, uh, I'm going to go to bed. Let's try again tomorrow. Just kidding. But uh, what a terrible way to start. What a terrible day. Get the leap attack. It also knocks them back. It's only a two-point investment. But I tell you what, if it would save me from dying, it's probably worth it. Not that dying's like the end of the world, I hear, but like. I mean, I'm certainly not happy now. I mean, I have n absolutely no gold. Oh, just kidding. I have some gold, but not enough. It's a terrible day. Uh, yeah, sure, Skunky, if you wouldn't mind, that would 
be good. Although, I don't know how to invite you. I didn't realize, yeah, if I die again, I lost my gear. I, that would be terrible. Just go online. Online. Should be online. Take a look for leap here. Leap. Where's leap? Leap attack. What is this? Leap into the air. Knock back nearby enemies. You're, you suggest leap attack, you're saying? it does damage I guess right the leap just jumps and knocks back Barbara bro <laughs> hey Barbara bro hey man High hills. Thanks for the help, Skunky. I appreciate it. I don't know how to do this. TP, maybe? Help you get here. You're already fighting, maybe? You're too fast for me. Nice little whirlwind action. Thank you, Skunky. Thanks, man. Much appreciated. I, I'd probably just quit playing if I lost my gear at this point. So. <laughs> Thanks, man. Let's go horking. Much appreciated, skunk man. Hey, what's up, Gimp? You left something in town? Uh-oh. How's it going, Gimp? Uh-oh. Oh, a little gold. Wow, thanks. Uh-oh. <laughs> you slipped <laughs> what do you mean slip jeez dude well thank you skunky I was gonna um 
I was going to sell these blue items to try to get my companion back. That was the plan the whole time? Oh, you dastardly foe. But much appreciated, man. I thought this blue thing was... Um, there's some other... The Mephisto stone or whatever? It looks like that's similar. D2 is pretty good. Skunky just came and saved my butt. I had died and... I didn't have enough gold to resurrect my companion. <coughs> Plus 5% experience gained. I just... I've never seen that stat on anything. That's hilarious. Jeez. Plus four, plus level 30 Hydra. That's funny. Holy cow, man. Well, I'm juiced to the gills now. Gimp, you're one hour behind me, so what are you doing up at 4.30 in the morning? That's from Uber Diablo. Well, I appreciate it, Skunky. Thanks very much, man. The point of this character is to farm gear with magic find, so anything to help me do that is, is good. Thank you. Yeah, I remember that torch on my druid helped me, helped me finish um, bail or yeah bail on uh, on this level. But dude, this is kind of ridiculous. Let's let's first resurrect my guy. And what's ridiculous is the amount of plus plus skills I have now. Uh, thanks for the gold, too, by the way. That will help any more deaths. <laughs> yeah, thanks. There's nothing worse than blowing through, like, two sessions worth of gold because you, uh... Uh-oh, I have a text message. On the off chance my wife fell back asleep, I will not respond to that. Gimp says on my ridiculous D Gen Gamer bowl again. Had to happen sometime. <laughs> what are you, uh, does that mean you're gaming something? Doing a little cyber. What was that game called? Cyber Punk? I forget. Uh, what was I going to do? Alright, so we got him. Let's get some potions. Hello. Because I wanted to see what my plus skills are at this point. Because it's ridiculous. Plus nine! <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Level 29 Berserk. <laughs> Level 29 Battle Orders. Like, get, get out of town with this. 2.4 KHP? Yeah, dude. Man, I'm a, I'm a monster now. Forgetting the title Cyberpunk. I haven't played in a few days. I was convinced to make the most of my remaining RuneScape membership and keep playing till it's over. Yeah, man, you can't get away from RuneScape that easy. You had 5k HP with battle orders? Dude, that's crazy. Kind of like. I'm not fully awake yet. 
Got to save money till next year. Yeah, you said you're going to a music festival. What? Just out of curiosity, what what festival are you looking forward to? I went to Warp Tour, <laughs> like almost twenty years ago. <laughs> that was fun. Three seasons of ladder barb gear dropped into one character. On your 5K HP. Wasn't that sponsored by Vans? Uh, very well may have been. I don't remember completely at this point. Probably a trance festival called Dream State in SoCal. Dang, dude. Didn't know you were in the trance music. Well, good luck saving up the money. I'm sure it's not cheap to uh, get to Southern California and back. But it sounds like a, a good time. I guess to be fair, I didn't know what kind of music you were into. All right, now I'm unstoppable with Skunky's uh, help. Uh, all right, let's go. I'm tired. What the heck is happening? <laughs> I didn't realize I had, what is that, Inferno or something? I forget the name of that. I'm gonna have to take another look. I thought that was just a normal pack of bats. It was an elite pack. Yeah, what the heck was that? That wasn't Hydra, of course. Oh, Firestorm, I guess. I got so many procs. I got, like, Poison Nova. A couple others, maybe. I'm <laughs> My barbarian so powerful he has the same moves as Diablo. There's a big pack of elite just howl or shout. Oh my god, dude. I should have freaking howled. I wasn't thinking. I could have just howled. I have it on F6. That would have stopped me from dying. That's what I get for playing Diablo at 5 a.m. Yeah, Poison Nova. I like the sound of it, too. It has, like, this, like, I don't even know, like, a low, like, a spraying sound or something. It's hard to describe, but I like the sound that it makes. Gimp says, I miss games like this. I'm sure I've said this, but I used to play Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance back in the day. And Champions of Norath. Very nice. I... I like games like this, obviously, since I'm playing it, but they don't really, well, I was going to say they don't really make games like this anymore, but I think Path of Exile is pretty similar in game approach, game design approach. Baldur's Gate 3 is one of the better games Skunky's played in a long time. Yeah, I, I bought Baldur's Gate 3 
and it was really cool, but for some reason I, I just haven't played very much of it. Probably shouldn't have bought it, to be honest, because I didn't, didn't really get my money's worth out of it yet, but I felt it should, uh, I felt like I should support games that make the kind of games I want to play, <laughs> because that's more rare than anything these days. Most game companies make games I don't want to play. But I've never played any of the other Baldur's Gates. I uh, always kind of meant to. You know how it goes. <laughs> yeah, I think at this point, Skunky, I would probably just like start over if I play Baldur's Gate again. Make another character. <laughs> Excuse me. Turn-based combat system. I didn't mind it, but I had nothing to compare it against, I guess. The only other really combat turn-based I can think of is like the early Fallouts and Jagged Alliance. I don't know if I love turn-based combat, but like I don't... Some games it just makes sense. Ah, man, I don't... Appreciate you guys hanging here. Like, I'm not even playing the game. I just kind of feel terrible. I'm not sick, but I'm just like, I don't know. I've been up since 3.30. My stomach is empty, and I'm trying to put coffee in it. Heroes of Might and Magic, an old PS2 game. I'm pretty sure that was on PC as well. Back in the day. Holy, let me think. Oh, man. No. About 20 years ago, I used to play Heroes of Might and Magic 3 on PC. And... I love that game, in a way. I was never any good at it, but I liked it. That's another game I always meant to revisit. I really just want to win the lottery so that I can quit all of my responsibilities and just play all of the video games I want. Skunky's just chilling. Why so early? Uh my son didn't sleep so hot. My wife was with him from like one or something to four. And at some point, Penelope needed to go outside. So my wife called me because she couldn't really juggle both. And uh, long story short, I tried to put my son to sleep and he finally did like right before 5 a.m. So, yeah. There's multiple entities in my house that prevent me from having any amount of decent sleep. And I don't really sleep that good right now the way it is even if I had nothing to interrupt. You could also get a different merc with like prayer or might aura. I do lack attack rating, to be honest. Just notice you use holy freeze. I've just been with this guy. I picked him up and I just kept him. <laughs> Holy Freeze? I'm not sure. He has Defiance. Increase when active. How do I make it active? Get coffee in my system. Yeah, I got two big mugs of coffee here. 
Where where's Holy Free Skunky? I'm I'm not sure I'm following completely. That's always active? Okay, cool. He's not holy freeze. Ah, okay, gotcha. Yeah, I figured the defiance was good. Although it doesn't really help when he dies. Uh, uh. Yeah, I need to get point into leap attack. What else is new, Gimp? Anything good? I'm the Diablo now. Shit, <laughs> what? See? Oh, okay. I was gonna say, what? Oh, I can't. I hit anything. Can't hit anything. Put the names of everyone you follow who's online into a random roller and raid that person. Uh, sounds like too much work. Oh, wait. Sorry. I'm using uh, Restream, and I didn't realize, Gimp, that you had uh, Redeem Guide the Raid. So, sounds good, man. Thanks for redeeming Guide the Raid. I gotta keep Twitch open as well as this restream chat window. Sounds good to me, Gimperoony. Gimperoony. Quite the name, nickname. It's like Gimp if he was a beefaroni brand. Beefaroni is great, right? This is a double elite pack. You can get surrounded. My stupid minion's gonna die again because he's stupid. A big dummy. A big dumb dummy. Can I get the heck out of here before I get killed again? Same nonsense, different day, you know how it is. In a bit of a gaming slump. Yeah, man, going so hard in RuneScape to not playing much at all is quite the transition, if you ask me. Keybind TP? Oh, that's a good idea, actually. Gimperoni. Do I need to create food merch? <laughs> Probably not, but in theory it'd be funny. I don't know why I can't clear Halls of the Dead. It's kind of starting to annoy me. Kind of starting to annoy me because all I want to do is get XP. Wheelchair shaped macaroni. You know the wagon wheel pasta? 
the pasta shapes, which I haven't seen in a long time, by the way. Maybe they were like a Kraft mac and cheese only kind of thing. But it could be like a wagon wheel, you know, themed wheelchair pasta. I love that I'm giving you so much... What, it's like 5 a.m.? Nah, it's all good. It's going to keep... I don't know how to keep... How to key bind right now, actually. Let's see. Is it F F7? Oh, I'm an idiot. There, F7. <laughs> it's 5.47 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> and I've been up since 3.30. Like, the pathetic... Pathetic existence that I have. That didn't make sense, but... When I grew up, we had Smurf pasta. Really? I don't think I've ever seen Smurf pasta. <laughs> A little jealous, actually. <laughs> you think the Smurfs cartoon would live up today if I would watch it? Probably terrible, right? <laughs> Where you at, nerd? How many sarcophaguses are there or whatever? Oh yeah, maybe my guy could die again from normal zombies. That would be really like a good thing to have happen. Oh my god. I'm gonna die again, dude. I'm gonna... I'm gonna die. In real life. Gimp says, I remember the wagon wheels. I feel like they never cooked evenly. <laughs> yeah, half of them were always, like, you know, uncooked. Take a sip of coffee and breathe. I'm not having too good of a morning here. Last time I died, Skunky's like, oh, use Howl. And I'm like, oh, yeah. And then the next time it happened, I forgot again. Because I'm a shell of a man. Oh, hey, Skunky. <laughs> Skunky came back to help me. Help out this poor, pathetic noob. He's pathetic in every way. Thank you, Skunky, for coming back to save my pathetic self. What a loser I am. Press P for party invite. Did I?
Thank you, Skunky. Maybe with any luck, you don't have to hold my hand the whole stream. Let me just get to town. I think it's funny too, Skunky, that you told me that uh, the blacksmith will heal you. I didn't even realize that. Can't do it now, but for 20 more dollars I can buy Diablo 3 with the expansion in addition to Diablo 2. <laughs> Skunky and I both, Skunky more so, have played thousands and thousands of hours of Diablo 3. I don't know how to describe it. Like, I really liked playing Diablo 3 at the time. But I don't think I would play it anymore. That's not to say that you wouldn't enjoy it. But it's, uh... If I'm going to play Diablo at this point, it's Diablo 2. Oh yeah, I for, kind of forgot about that, Skunky. I, I mean, not, not forgot, forgot. But we didn't kind of meet through the D3 community. We definitely met through this one streamer that has long disappeared. Diablo 2 is definitely worth it if you want. I don't know if you could call it like a ball. Is it? I don't know if you could call it a Baldur's Gate style game because it's it's not. But it's like before the time where video games were made for consoles more than PCs. Because by the time Diablo 3 came out, it was basically like, let's make this for console. And then the game design is all wrapped around that, you know. I enjoyed it a bit, Diablo 3. My sister's ex was a bit of a gaming addict, so it was a bit much, got old fast. This guy played too much Diablo 3. D2 got me into PC gaming, has a special place for me. My buddy Manet, that uh, frequents the stream, when we were in middle school, he showed me Diablo 1. And I remember we actually installed it on a computer at school <laughs> and that's how I started with Diablo he played too much of several games that I don't enjoy anymore as a result now I kind of poisoned the well for you huh I love the itemization says skunky there's still items I find that amaze me after 20 years yeah there's something to be said about the items in Diablo. It feels satisfying to find a unique. It's fun to collect them, for me, I think. Um, the set items are interesting. In Diablo 3, the set items come way too easy. So when you get set item bonuses in Diablo 2, it's not, it's not easy to do, so it feels great pretty rewarding
And of course, the whole rune word system is something that I haven't even really touched much yet. Oh my god. Alright, well, let's see if I can not die again. Because all I want to do is get one more point so that I can... Get leap, I guess. Yeah, I want to stay alive. Uh, 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 staying alive, staying alive. Uh, 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 uh. Don't be a noob. Three socketed tusk sword. Can't be repaired though. Yeah, I have 95 stats. I probably should put more into life, huh? Or something. Alright, this is not gonna... I should just get out of here. Owl! Run away! <laughs> Come here, you! You know, Skunky, I don't know, do I, do you think I really need Leap if I just would remember to use Howl? I probably don't need to be that stingy about my skill points, but... To put some in Vitality? Yeah, I probably should. I won't always have Skunky to come save the day. Dude, last night, Skunky, listen to this, how big of a noob I am. I was in the maggot layer, you know, that it's like the tunnels, where like if there's just one enemy in front of you, you can't get past. Of course, I died in there. And the mobs that were in there were the the bug swarms that were immune to physical damage. So my minion or my companion wouldn't even help kill them. And I'm like, what the heck? Singing staying alive as you die would be the ultimate irony. They called me King Iron. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I'm just losing my mind. Who would call me King Iron? <laughs> wow, I don't know why that... I'm in trouble today, boys. Leap Skunky would still get it. It's handy on some maps. It's like a ghetto teleport. That's fair. You hate the maggot layer? Yeah. They call me King Iron. Oh yeah, who calls you that? They do. All right, I finally cleared stupid level one of Halls of the Dead. This is all for a waypoint too, by the way. I don't even need anything in here. Yeah, I'm I'm losing it, kid. I'm losing it, buddy. There's too many monsters in here.
Powell. Thanks, Gunky. Appreciate the reminder. Hey, what's up, Jules? Sorry, I forgot to put the bot on. What's going on, Jules? Good morning, man. Let's get a little shabby going here. Not too shabby. Oh, baby. What's up, Jules? Good morning. All this pain for a waypoint that you don't need? Yeah. It's like an OCD thing that I just want the waypoint. I don't even... I'm not well today. Jules in the house. Happy Wednesday, I suppose. Better than Tuesday, anyway. I've died twice so far this morning, Jules, and Skunky has come save me both times. So, big props to Skunky today. For helping out a noob like me. Oh! Let's start the day right with a sub-anniversary. Oh, baby! Jules, thank you very much for the subscription, man. I appreciate that. A monster 46 months of subscription. That's monstrous. What more can I say, Jules? But thank you very much for your continued support, and I hope that you continue enjoying all of the nonsense that uh, we're up to here. Thanks, man. Completionist mentality, I understand that. Yeah, it's, uh, as you probably would know, Gimp, it it's, can be a curse and a blessing. Poison traps. Let's not get cornered in the side of the room there. Well, my companion's gonna die, I guess. What a fool! F7! I'm not gonna fight without my companion. I'm gonna try to learn a lesson here. You kind of died in bad places to get your corpse back? Felt the pain? <laughs> I appreciate that. Gimp, let me show you, man. Look at this. I have the Far Oasis waypoint. I have the Dry Hills waypoint. See this guy here that I don't have? Now, how could I go to sleep at night? If I complete Act 2 and I get all, I get Lost City, Palace Settler, Arcane Sanctuary, Canyon of the Magi, I get all these waypoints. But not Halls of the Dead level 2? What the heck would that be? Right? So that's why I'm doing this. You need some help? What is this? Oil potion? I don't even know what that does. Okay. I kind of like that there's items in this game, though, that, like, you really don't ever need to use. <laughs> I feel like there could be, you know, get 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 like forks and silverware in, in games. Every item in a game doesn't have to have a use. It's just a uh, world building. What's your day like today, Jules? Hopefully you got a... What's the word? An easy day of work ahead of you, but uh, who knows, I guess. Whoa. What's up, boys?
This is probably where the cube would be if I needed to get the cube. The Hordratic, Horadric cube, excuse me. Uh oh. I still need to remember to put like 20 points into vitality. <laughs> Howl! Forget to howl once, shame on me. Forget to howl twice, shame on me as well. But I won't forget the third time. <laughs> Run away, minion. Let's take the battle to open ground. I don't need to be berserking all these things down, but I feel like it would take too long to kill them all otherwise. The attack speed when you zerk is hilarious. Yeah, it's it's pretty ridiculous. And now only if my attack rating was better so that I could actually hit a little more often. I guess I could put points into dexterity, but that just doesn't feel quite right. Unless it's for gear. But uh, I also don't know what I'm talking about. A little war staff action? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I mean, I probably don't need a war staff, but. I can. What the heck is in here? Oh my god. F7! Jewel says, my day should go well. Another day at work. Looking forward to the weekend. I worked all weekend this past weekend, so you didn't have a weekend. Dude, that's not so good. I hope that you're going to get a nice weekend upcoming then. F7! <laughs> it's like one of those superheroes that like the only way their powers work is if they say it out loud. Tornado! Heart! I think I should have an okay day at work today, Jules. Thanks for asking. I don't want to jinx myself, but... <sighs> what did I come here for? I don't remember. Oh. I really like the look at the, of this uh, weapon, like in the inventory. It looks like a mix between a sword and a cleaver. I like it. <laughs> Cube stuff. Thanks, Gunky. Appreciate it. Now, let's go back. And get my war staff. <laughs> I can't ah! more. I didn't even get the waypoint. And the cube wouldn't be here. It probably would be in level three. Hey, what's up, Rose? Long time no chat. How you doing today? Good to see you. Uh... I love the Berserk Axe from Melee. Which one is that? Is it named Berserk Axe? Never mind. 
F7. <laughs> There's an axe that is really cool. I wonder if it's the one you're referring to. Uh, this one. The Minotaur. I guess it's not what you're referring to, but I think it looks really sweet. It's been a while. I'm sick with a cold right now. I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully we'll clear up soon. It's also my birthday today. Hey, happy birthday, Rose. I hope you have a really good day today. Do you have anything fun planned or maybe just taking it easy? Happy birthday to you. Oh boy, this is dangerous. Howl. I have that on my classic barb a bit. I wish, I don't think, well, I'm not using axes at all, I guess, but I kind of wish I was just because it looks so cool. Packs are in this place. Run away, companion. Not much planned today. Uno momento. Howl. Sarcophagus in here? No. My dad and I are supposed to go out tomorrow if we're both well enough. Well, I hope that you can do that. Maybe go out for a meal, perhaps? I want to go out for a nice big steak, but I'm not going to, I just want to. I'm not gonna, I just wanna. There's a concert we're supposed to be going to, so hope the cold clears off. Ah, oh, very nice. Well, I hope so too. I've kind of been perpetually sick for a year ever since my son went to daycare, so I <coughs> understand your pain. Did that snow clear up for you, Jules? Oh boy. You had said it was gonna warm up and probably melt all the snow. No snow here yet this season, although I thought there was maybe a chance of it today, but I don't know. <clears throat> I feel like, <clears throat> I feel like the forecast only matters like an hour before it matters. Howl! Because it just changes too often. Technically, this barb is even ready and able to farm any item in the game. In Act 1, there's 
The pit? Oh, nice. Where's the pit? I forget. I guess I should pay attention. F7. Let's heal up my companion so I don't keep wasting money. That's a long time to be sick. I'm just kind of being sarcastic. I haven't been sick literally a year. But I'm a little sick now. Not too bad. But as soon as I get over one sickness, another one comes via daycare. All the snow left the same day? That's good. Hopefully you didn't have to like shovel it or anything. And here's finally the stupid waypoint that I've been looking for for 8,000 years. Let's get the heck out of here. I like sand maggots because they like really don't do anything and I can just zerk them to pieces. Same with these stupid swarms of bugs. Itchies. <laughs> Their name is Itchies. Wow. Get, get smushed. It's in the Temo Highlands, which is just south of the Outer Cloister Waypoint. Okay, got you. Should go hit it up. What's up, boys? Hey, what's up, Phoenix? Good morning. Good to see you, Phoenix. How are you doing today? Look at this carnage. Oh, I love it. I'm the lotion to your itchies. Oh, did I get a raid? Sorry, sorry. Phoenix, thank you for the raid. Uh, I'm still getting used to a new chat window that apparently does not give me all... You are mine now. You belong to me. <clears throat> it apparently does not give me all the alerts I should, and I always forget to have a raid notification. Thank you very much, Phoenix, for the raid. My apologies for not realizing it right away. Chris Technic, hey, thanks very much for the follow, Chris. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good day. How was your stream, Phoenix? What were you up to? Chris in the house. Good morning, Chris. I'm assuming it's morning for you. F7. I want to check out the pit that Skunky's referring to. Love Diablo 2? Nice. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Uh, the Diablo 2 Resurrected is... A lot of fun. I made a druid maybe a year ago. Kind of lost interest in the druid for now. So now, <sighs> playing a barbarian. Phoenix Stream was good. Was playing a spooky game for Halloween. Very nice. It's barely morning for you. 12.21 a.m. Dang, man. Where might you be? Hawaii? Are you in Hawaii? I always played played Druid. It's a lot of fun. I did a pet Druid. And the pet Druid's kind of funny because you have like, I don't know, literally 30 different pets all around you. But as Skunky and I have discussed a few times in the past, it uh, never seems to... Like, it's just a very slow killing build like it's a little too slow after a while 
I am indeed in Hawaii. Nice, man. Well, uh, cheers to you. Uh, a really good friend of the stream named Kona Girl, go figure, is also from Hawaii. I've never been to Hawaii, and I probably will never be to Hawaii. So I will live vicariously through Chris Technic. Three AM for Phoenix on the West Coast, I believe. Well it's good to see you guys. I'm just having like a kind of a wild, crazy morning stream here. I've died a few times. Skunky had to come save me. Skunky is referring to this place called the Pit that I can't think of off the top of my head, so I'm going to go find it in Act 1. Kona is on a different island than me. Do you know Kona Girl? Or is Kona... I'm not sure what Kona is. Is it a, a place? Excuse my ignorance about Hawaii. I've yet to go to bed. Hopefully you don't have to get up too early, Phoenix. High level rune, that'd be nice. So you're saying, uh... <laughs> I almost get killed. Was that two elite packs on top of each other? I guess that's what happened there. Uh, might find a high rune. Let's go. That was two elites. That was probably like ten elites, right? Whatever makes me feel better for almost dying. I don't know Kona Girl, but Kona is a place on the big island. Gotcha, Chris. My bad for not knowing that. Have you always lived in Hawaii, Chris, just out of curiosity? You don't have to answer anything you don't want to, but, uh, live there your whole life? I want to visit Hawaii, says Phoenix, but at this rate I'd have to win the lottery, right? I'm not really a fan of planes. I watch too many terrible internet videos to really want to fly. And I don't really... Feel like that's a rational fear because it's not really rational, but it's like I just don't want to, you know. And at some point, you grow up and you're like, you know what? I'm tired of tired of doing stuff I don't want. <laughs> if I don't want to do it, I don't want to do it. And I'm probably gonna have to fly. My wife is gonna want to go somewhere, and I'm gonna try to not let my irrational fears prevent my wife from living a full life. So I'll probably drink like a bottle of wine or something and then drink enough wine that you don't care if your plane die, uh, crashes and so on and so forth. As a bird, flying doesn't bother me. Well, that's good. And that makes sense. Wouldn't be too much of a phoenix if you didn't want to fly, I guess. Thorn Beast. You're good. Not many people are familiar with the non-famous places like Waikiki. I feel like I have heard of Waikiki, actually. I don't know why, but... Is that like a beach, maybe? I don't know what I'm talking about. Skunky says, I get motion sickness in cars and trains, but I love to fly. Really? 
Spooky, you're saying the pit is on this path, right? I'm on the, the right track here. Oh, hey, ladies. Hey, ladies! It's a Beastie Boy reference, if anyone was wondering. Not a very good one, but one nonetheless. You know, I'm like, oh, is Waikiki a beach? You know, if I think about it hard enough. Like, probably most places in Hawaii are a beach, right? To some degree. It should be along the path. Loads of elites along the way. That's what I need, baby. That's sweet XP. Any Beastie Boys reference is a good one. That's how I feel. Jeez! Almost got sniped by a pack of hedgehogs. Or porcupines, I mean. More! Owl! Man, you weren't kidding, dude. There's elites out the wazoo here. Sorry, I worded that weird. Waikiki is one of the popular tourist places. Okay, I got you, Chris. That makes sense. Only had one trick-or-treater, says Phoenix, at my house, but I live in an apartment complex, so it wasn't expecting much, if anything. We didn't get any. Uh, but that's fine with me. To be, I mean, I don't mean to be like... A bummer. Jeez Louise, such a delicate operation. I agree, Jules. Let's see if we can find that sound. I don't really want trick-or-treaters. Jeez Louise, what a delicate operation. I feel like there's been too many stories of like people knocking on doors and then like people shooting through the door at them. Like, that kind of stuff in the news is going to make trick-or-treating a thing of the past. Pulled into my driveway, did you? Well, I am going to shoot. Alright, let's continue to find the pit. GG, Jules, GG. Oh, okay, I know the pit now. Sorry for the sniffles. Let's go do the pit. Let's go do the pit. Oh baby, let's go do the pit. Let's go do... A dimensional blade. It's a blade from another dimension. Uh, would love to see if there's some... Oh boy. Uh, well. That there is a six socket. 
sword. And I think the first one I've ever found. Always shiny chests on level 2 at the end as well, but the elites can be spicy. With Hal should be fine. Keep that for future rune word. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, man. I don't really know what rune words are good for swords, but... When you say future rune word, it's not worth doing at this point, Skunky, you don't think? Let's, uh, identify our war staff. Plus one to sorcerer skills. Alright, well I don't really care about that. But I'll save it for a rainy day. Yeah, I'm not sure... Well, if I got any good runes or not, but appreciate you checking, man. I'll continue to slaughter in the meantime. Whoa, Nelly. Howl. Two elite packs on in one here. That helps explain the difficulty there. Got some set boots. Maybe not now, but keep it if you find an Ist and Vex. Yeah, I don't think I have a Vex. May or may not have an Ist. But I'll, I'll hang on to it. I haven't found any six-socketed swords, so I'm definitely going to keep it. I'm gonna get both of those runes from this chest. I keep forgetting to put the points into vitality as well. The highest rune you had is this, gotta find a Vex.
Yeah, I, I'm fairly certain I definitely don't have a Vex. I forget what I was going to do. Oh, I was going to put points into Vitality. <laughs> I put a little 20 in. Which I think only gave me like 100 life, but... Reapply battle orders. I, yeah, I think I got another, almost another hundred out of that. What's up, bro? Howl. I feel like for these fallen, Howl should make them attack you. Just because their normal behavior is to run away anyway. That'd be funny. Not really that funny. Interesting twist. Fear makes fallen ones aggro. Yo, we're reverse psychology. They're such a classic Diablo monster, though, you know? Just because they're a classic monster doesn't make them any less annoying, but... Yeah, I don't know. Level 2. Bring the pain right away. Ice Flame? That's an oxymoron.
Boy, oh boy, there's a lot of monsters here. Hello. Boy, would it be nice to get a level. Ah, ah. Owl. No! F7! Having a bit of a tough time here, Skunky, but it's going to be worth it when I get all the runes I need. This one chest. Place is my favorite spot to farm, says Skunky. Since the treasury level is the same as Diablo and Bale, and there's so many elites, I I've definitely cleared the pit before, but I didn't realize that it was so, uh, you know, such a good spot to, to farm. A little flawless sapphire for my troubles. Can't win them all, uh, I guess. Are we done horking? Let's, uh, I need to get this level before I stop. Let's go to the dark wood and kill some yetis. Maybe. There's an elite pack in the woods. Whoa, Nelly. There we have it. Woot woot! So skunky. Leap, huh? Pull the trigger. I'll put one point into leap and it'll be level 10, which is pretty crazy.
Let's do it. Leap. Level 10 leap. It's handy to get out of sticky situations and cut off the maps in Act 3. That's true. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Uh, where's Leap? F8. <laughs> Ideally, you want the one beneath it so it also knocks back. Yeah. But I guess you gotta get this one to get this one, right? So. What is this? Oh, Whirlwind, okay. Double swing? I don't care about double swing, right? When two weapons are equipped, attack two p targets if possible. Uh, I don't think I care. Berserk has no synergy. Nah. That's all about single attack, obviously. This is the way we go to school. Go to school. Go to school. This is the way we go to school every single day. This is the way we jump the fence. Jump the... No, can't jump the fence. Jump the fence. This is the way we jump the fence. I'm tickled pink. Whoop! 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 Little, uh, leap root pack here. I think that guy's name was Tree Hard Woodfist. Of course, my stupid idiot died. Ah, F7. <laughs> F7. Bobby has lost his mind. Yeah, man. Ugh. Ugh. Skunky, thanks again, man, for all the help today. I appreciate it. Because I, if I lost my gear, that would be a monumental setback. And I probably would have to take a break from playing. So I appreciate your time and effort. Thanks again, Skunky, for uh, the subscription a la 10 gigahertz. And thank you, Jules, very much for the subscription. I have to go to work in nine minutes, which is kind of a bummer. But I got a level... I'm level 79 now, which is pretty, pretty sweet. And Skunky hooked me up with a couple of nice charms. I'm in good shape for uh, continuing progress on my Barbarian here. Losing gear or XP is no good. Yeah, I mean, even the XP, it's not fun, but, like, you could make that up. But if you lost a bunch of gear, like... I mean, obviously, I have all sorts of gear in my stash, and I could assemble something. But I'm obviously wearing what I have right now is the best that I have. So, Gimp, uh, Gimp redeemed guide the raid, and he said to put all the people I follow in a wheel. But the only person that's live right now is Shadowstone. So we can go and raid Shadowstone. Thanks, Gimp, for redeeming. And it's nice to see you too, Jules. Thanks for being here, man. Hope you have a good day. Rose, take care. If you can't get back, best thing to do is remake the game so your gear is in town. 
Oh, okay. I didn't even... I, I thought that if I left the game, I would lose my stuff. So, it looks like that's one surefire way to never lose your gear. At the cost of XP. That's good to know. I didn't know that, Skunky. But... All right, guys, Shadowstone is playing a little Minecraft, so we can go say hello if you'd like. Otherwise, guys, I will see you all next time. Thanks again for the subscriptions, guys, and just for being here.